Dr. Clayton Roach here from Roach Chiropractic Center, bringing you more valuable content and commonly asked questions that I get in clinic. Now today I want to address a, a question that I get when people get osteoarthritis and their pain level starts to rise and people are starting to, to wonder, are there any other types of treatments that I can do? And one of those treatments that's offered in the medical profession is cortisone. Now you have to realize that cortisone at the very best is going to minimize some of the symptoms from osteoarthritis but will not regenerate cartilage and will not prevent further degeneration. Now people typically will go to a cortisone shot or take corticosteroids when the pain has gotten to a level where it's starting to affect their daily lives. Now corticosteroids, I just picked up an article here, um, have very dramatic effects. Now this is the corticosteroids that people are usually taken by pills. Uh, it says it can have side effects, some can be dangerous such as greater risk of infection, weight gain, ulcers in your digestive tract, and bleeding, osteoporosis, increases in blood pressure, and blood glucocortisol levels, and eye problems such as cataracts and glaucoma. Realize that injections of cortisone will minimize many of those risks. And many of cortisone injections are done to knees, hips, shoulders, uh, thumbs, and some can be done by your doctor, while some more uh, in dangerous, in, in dangerous uh, areas like the spine need to be done with imaging. Now, even with those injections, there are some side effects. This article names a few. Thinning of cartilage, the smooth covering that protects the bone and the joints. Weakening of the ligaments of that joint being injected. More inflammation in the joint caused by a corticosteroid that has crystallized. Irritation of the nerves by the needle or the medication itself. Infecting the joint that's being injected. Whitening or thinning of skin at the injection site. Now, again, realize that cortisone is only going to limit the symptoms of osteoarthritis and definitely not fix anything. Now, this article goes on to say that most experts say you should limit injections to no more than once every three or four months and get no more than about four shots in any joint. Now, I have seen patients that have gotten six or seven shots in the same joint and have actually developed osteoporosis within that joint and the bones that make up that joint. Whenever there is a symptom, there is a cause to that symptom. And it, it is very, very important for you to detect what that cause is. Because when you detect what the cause is, you can ascertain certain treatment options that are going to be more favorable than just minimizing the symptom. Chiropractic has proven very, very effective with a lot of common conditions that people are seeking cortisone injections for. Again, Dr. Clayton Roach inviting you to take care of your body and be healthy